just a ton of fun. Well, falling out of that boat was not fun, but you're going to see a lot of this today. Boats hitting the Ohio River this afternoon, but not just any kind of boats. Dozens will be testing out their creative cardboard creations at the annual Cardboard Boat Regatta. It's part of New Richmond's River Days. Local 12's Megan Moore joins us live now from New Richmond to fill us in on what we can expect today. You are holding my trophy. I'm going to take that baby home today, Megan. I don't know, Adam. I may or may not have poked a hole in one of these boats. What? I'm not going to tell you which one. Come on. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Maybe. I'm here with Tom Lemon, who actually created these boats. Uh, how long do you think this took you? Uh, we work as a team here, work mm -hmm. building the boats as volunteers. Uh, we can build a boat like that probably in about two weeks if we stay on it. That's not bad. How long, I, I'm sure for, for those, you know, the people who are doing this for the first time, I would imagine you probably come across some struggles and I'm sure they ask yes. you you know how do I make this float yeah um, your first time boat builders are usually building a square boat yeah over the years we've kind of changed them where we're getting some roundness to them and getting them a little more sleek design and over the years so you guys have been this is actually the cardboard boat racing museum so you're seeing a, a lot of elaborate boats in here how do you come up with these ideas? I mean, is it just kind of random and you just see if you can, you can accomplish it? It's just random. Uh, someone will say, hey, let's build an ambulance this year. So we'll build an ambulance. Just not sure what comes up. And so for the races today, there are different classes uh, that people are, are going to be racing in? Yes, we have uh, single crew and multi-crews. We have youth category and adult category. And then we have a mechanical class where you're allowed to use metal, wooden, plastic for your propulsion and your steering, okay. but it can't add to the structure of your boat. Everything has to be cardboard, tape, and paint. Okay. And if you win, you take home one of these? We're giving away about 29 trophies this year. So we got Most Creative, a Spectator Award, Snappy Dresser Award. We got the Most Dramatic Sinking, the Titanic Award. That'll be Adam. <laughs> yeah, I seen him go over last year. He did. He tried. Uh, Bob was a little shaky in his boat, too. But Bob mentioned how fast they were last year. I love it. Well, the boats look good. I hope you guys look good in them and uh, don't sink this year, Adam. Megan, you're doing an awful lot of talking for somebody who's not going to actually get in a boat. So my challenge to you is why don't you come down and join us at 1 o'clock. You can use my boat, maybe give it a little test run before I jump in. How's that oh, sound? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Megan? Maybe I will. Okay, well, I'll see you on the river. <laughs> and you can check out more of the elaborate boats people have made in the past at the Cardboard Boat Museum website. The Titanic Award? That's going to be on. yours. No, it's not. <laughs> All right.